AG the Poet versus B Magic. Here's an interesting matchup. Let's just put it out there, Battle Rap fans. Don't try to act like this one isn't juicy. Because first off, KG the Poet gets hate mail. He does, Stro. <laughs> I, I feel he's he's a sleeper. He's, he's in a sleeper cell. A lot of Battle Rap fans are sleeping on KG the Poet. I'm just going to put that out there. This is the same guy that put Snow in check. Real quick on the rooftop. Yeah, man. I mean, that, and that that was the that was the you know the problem with UFF is it really did hurt some guys' momentum, man. And I think KG's momentum was really kind of just squashed for a moment until he kind of you know arose on the West Coast, running the West Coast PGs. But for a moment there, that UFF lackluster performance they 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 weren't able to prepare like they usually prepare. And uh, they were just kind of squashed and, and and overwhelmed by snow. You know, the, the UFF did did do that. I think when you deal with the West Coast MCs, and, and shouts out to the big homies, Smack, Beasley, Twiz, the whole gang over there, Norris. But I think, you know, I love the fact that URL brought in some West Coast MCs in the UFF, but – on that stage, on BET, a lot of the fans weren't familiar with them because they they were stuck on URL's channel. Let's just be real. I would say probably 50% of the fans weren't really that familiar with KG the Poet and or Danny Myers. Uh, so and, and so you get you get a performance that wasn't the best. I mean, even Danny Myers lost to Snow. Right? KG the Poet didn't have the best performance. And then the fans that are familiar with them kind of judge them stroll right on that. You with me there? Yeah, yeah. But for for this battle, I'm at, I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with KG. KG's been real nice lately. Um, B Magic has been doing his thing, and and, and he, the the problem with calling a battle against B Magic is what he does. He does so well. Um so consistently that it's easy to take it for granted. It's easy to, you know, kind of not n- not give due credit to the skill set that he has and the bars that he brings to the table for every three rounds of every battle. But I'm looking at a West Coast battle with KG the Poet. He's going to be on home field um, advantage. And, and he's going to be aggressive. It's URL. He's back. I don't think he's been on URL TV in a while. So he's back on URL TV. He's hungry. I mean, B Magic doesn't really have anything to lose. KG the Poet has everything to lose in this battle. So I'm thinking the hunger from KG is going to take it. Maybe I'm going to say 2 1. I'm not seeing B Magic getting 3 0 by anybody anytime soon. So I'm going to say 2 1. I'm not calling the rounds. KG the Poet. <laughs> I, I'm definitely going to give it to KG the poet, um, but it's going to be close. And I think ultimately this battle will be a debatable. And I think that this battle can be a battle of preference. Hmm? I think that if you like the two bar punches, the chain link bars, as we say over here at battle scene, that B magic can give you. I think that you will end up liking B Magic. I don't think B Magic is coming to Sunset Boulevard to play around with KG the Poet. After all, KG the Poet is kind of has been the liaison to get this West Coast URL scene popping. If Battle Rap fans paid attention to the PGs, KG the Poet put that piece together alongside of Aspect One. So let's be real. I don't think that B-Magic is coming to Sunset Boulevard to have average bars. I think he's coming to Sunset Boulevard to turn all the way up. I think that KG the Poet will win because B-Magic has so much material. KG the Poet, we've talked to him several times on our show. He is 300. He will study B-Magic. He will figure angles out. And guess who's on their home turf stroke? Yeah, I already said it. So. so this this is not the New York crowd, ladies and gentlemen. 
This is a California crowd. And with that said, I think that KG the poet, in my eyes, will edge B Magic. I'm going two to one. Uh, I'm not even going to call the rounds. Two to one. I agree with you, Stro. B Magic is going to come in somewhere, probably still around. But beyond that, I think KG the poet is in the a prime position to beat B Magic, and also. He's